been thinking. I wish we could all go on a road trip together. Road trip? Why bother? It's not like there's anything worth seeing anymore. Oh, come on. I'm sure there's plenty of stuff to see. Maybe Clem could show us around. You're able to get uh, a car working, and you know how to drive? Barely. Come on, bye. I love the open ride, road! But I'd love to learn. That sounds kind of nice. I love the open road. I wouldn't mind showing you around. Just as long as you're not the one driving. <laughs> Are we going to the car? No, bud. It's broken. Good. I'm sick of the car. <laughs> I wish this old rust bucket was still working. We could just jump in and start driving. We could take turns sitting in the back. It'd be like driving one of those cars with the top that goes down. We'd run out of gas eventually. Yeah, we still, would. It's fun to imagine, isn't it? <laughs> Where would you go, Clem? If you could drive anywhere you wanted, if gas wasn't an issue, or a busted carburetor, or flat tires, or the um... transmission, buzz kill. Let's go to the mountain road. I'd drive up one of those long roads that wind around the mountains. Follow it all the way to the top. You could see over the whole world up there, I bet. Yeah. Get a nice view of the world while you die of frostbite. Sounds like it's very emo. Why would it kill you to live a little? I've lived here Again, I don't blame her though, life. you know. Heck, I'd say I know every inch of these woods. I'd kind of like to unknow it. No use dreaming of what could be. We've got shit to do. Yeah, I guess we should get to work on those fish. We got spears inside the shack. Come on. You go ahead. I'll stay out here. Okay. Where are those spears? Hey. About by. No, it's I'm fine. Sorry I understand. She's being a little mean. It's my fault. What do you mean? I was there when those walkers killed Sophie and Minnie. They were really close with Vi, and I think she blames me for what happened to them. I mean, how do you even apologize well, for something that fucked up? It's not your fault, I, right? Maybe I deserve it. It wasn't your fault. These things happen. Still, I was the one that had to break the news to her. And ever since I did, she's become distant. We all used to be friends. I guess I just kind of missed that. But no, I don't blame go, you. I, I don't know. I just haven't seen her warm up to someone in a long time. Well, I guess that's a good thing, right? We should start fishing, probably. Do you? I mean, I hate to ask this of you, but do you think you could talk to her? Uh, sure. About me? Yeah. Something, I can I ask can her. her. Really? That's great. Thanks, yeah. Valentine. I'm gonna go check our fish traps downstream. See? I'll take this to Vi. There should be some extras lying around. Okay. Okay, find a spear. Oh, what's that? This is cool. Just grab everything. Why not grab dead animal Edgy. skulls? That's what we've been doing. Edgy! <laughs> oh god. Kinda creepy, but AJ might like it. Yeah, I'm sure that's what he'll like. Um, let's see if there's anything else I can look at. Hey, AJ, are you okay? Hey, you. What you looking at? V plus M. Violet and Minerva. What does that mean? They were together. They were girlfriends. It means that... They were good friends. Was what? Violet was Minnie's girlfriend. Oh. Love. Mm-hmm. That's so sad. I feel so bad. You know? You can tell she really loved her. Old gardening God damn it. Um. Okay, uh, let's get the spear on the other side. Cool. Good read.
very sharp. Ready to get some fish? <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's go. Hopefully, I actually get some fish. Can I join you? Sure. Thanks. Hey, check out these guys over here. They're swimming against the current. Guess they don't realize it makes them easier targets. I wanna try. Take a spear. Go nuts. <laughs> Go ahead and try. They're not running. God, if I- Do we actually have to catch them? Oh, fuck. Hey, I got one. Something. Good enough for me. Okay, we got one fish. Hey, sorry if I was weird last night about the whole room thing. No, Seems it's okay. In there, uh, it was harder than I expected. You'd think I'd be less sentimental by now. No, no, no. We didn't mean to upset you. <laughs> sorry, we weren't trying to upset you. No, no, it's okay. Seriously, it's. Kinda nice having someone in there again. Okay, let's see. Catching another fish. Damn it! Oh, I actually got it. Okay. Catch up, guys. The hole's not looking that great. Uh, yeah. Okay. <sighs> God. Sometimes she just gets on my last nerve. You know. So why do you hate her? <laughs> well, I mean it's. It's not like I hate her. I just... I wish we could all go on a road trip together. She I thinks you do! Oh, she definitely thinks you hate her. Okay. Um, maybe I shouldn't have brought it up. I don't know. Damn it! Did I get it? Ooh, okay, I got it. Looks like they wisened up. Maybe Brody had better luck with the traps. I got one! Come, I got AJ! One. <laughs> Good job. Good job, AJ. <laughs> so proud. Between us. With Brody. I don't know why it's like this. Why is it You're so You're just weird? upset at her because she's the one who told you your I girlfriend can never died. Relax around her. It just keeps getting worse. Because you blame her for what happened with the twins. Well, that's what I used to think. I just keep thinking that things might have ended differently if I was there. Maybe I could have protected Soph. And Minnie. She wants to talk about it, you know. I just... I feel guilty about the whole thing. Why? I was supposed to be out with the twins that day. I wanted to work in the greenhouse, so I asked Brody to cover for me. So then she feels guilty, that's why she's angry at her. I didn't even get to say goodbye. I... I wanted to talk to Brody. To tell her I didn't blame her for what happened, but every time I tried, I was reminded of who we lost. It was easier to just not talk about it. You should talk we about should it eventually. Going. You know? It's not gonna help if you just bottle it up inside. We caught some, but not a lot. I didn't get anything. We should catch up with Lewis and Asim. See if they had any better luck. I hope they did. The Grand Canyon. What? That's where I'd go. If we took a road trip, start driving until we hit the Grand Canyon. Yeah. That would be cool. Thanks. You're welcome. Hey, you slow folks coming? Yeah, we're right behind you.
Where are those guys? Yeah, Captain something doesn't seem right. Walker. Gross. I know. Poor Walker. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? I don't think some. Uh, what? Oh, what? This isn't normal. Someone sabotaged this. This isn't good. A uh, Sam. Lewis. Don't yell out their names. You don't know who the fuck's out there. Spread out. See if we can find them. Watch out for monsters. I don't like- why do they always say, let's spread out? You know how this is gonna end badly if they say that. Oh god. Hmm. Empty. Huh. Cigarette? Is this a Bible page? Flim, found some. Huh? What? What is it? Monster. Yeah. Guys, over here. And there's a well, spear we didn't through kill it. This one. We wouldn't have left it hanging in our trap. What the hell? Found this too. Do any of the kids smoke? Nope. Nothing to smoke. Who is this unlucky fella? Where have you been? Checking Dude. the traps. The ones that were sprung were all empty. All the rest are broken. Someone robbed us? Oh, great. And now we're gonna starve. Fuck. That's... Fuck. fuck. What? It's just... Fuck. It's okay. It's... Breathe, Brody. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. What's happening? You're gonna be fine. It's just a panic attack. Take a second. Breathe in deep. And hold it. Just shut the fuck up, okay? Excuse me? Whoa. I, I have to tell Marlon about this. Um, we still need food. You know, to live. We definitely don't have enough. Louis, shut the hell up. You guys figure it out. <laughs> okay. They know something's wrong, right? The reason why the perimeter is getting smaller and smaller. Maybe we can it's not because of walkers. Some. Pretty sure it's what not because do? of walkers. Eat rocks? You can't Apparently. Eat rocks. I'm aware. Will Marlin kick us out if we don't find food? Well, let's not find out. Where else could we look? <sighs> Let me think. Okay, um... I mean, the train station is a thing? The train station. It's not too far from here. But, Maybe, but it's not safe. Like safe zone. There was food in there when AJ and I passed through. It's worth a look. You sure there was food? Positive. Yeah, some of it was destroyed in the explosion, but there has to be something left. There was so much there. Or we could starve. Fine. Let's go. Oh no, I have a really bad feeling about this. That's just just me, right? Just that's just me. Bad feeling. Lots of walkers. Oh, more walkers than last time, though. We're gonna die. It's either die here I like how a lot of them don't have jaws anymore. Take your pick, Clem. Maybe you should scope things out. You know the place better. Okay. Let me get a closer look. Can't be too careful. Okay, we got body, train car, walkers. I climb up there. Don't know how that would get us inside. Yeah. We barely got out of here. It was close. Sounds scary. There's a reason. I need to get in there somehow. Maybe there's another way in. Um. That bell might be able to get the walkers' attention. They do like to follow sound. You look like you've got an idea. The noise from that bell could draw a lot of walkers. If one of us climbs up there and starts ringing it, Lewis, I vote Lewis. Uh, hold on. <laughs> I'd like to make an alternate suggestion. What's that? 
You're loud, dramatic, a little annoying. You're basically a welcome um, distraction. I think you mean charming and theatrical. You can do it! Okay, Prince Charming. Let's see those talents in action. I can't say no to a face like that. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> give you some cover. All right, Fine. thank you. I'll do it. But if I die, I'm making sure Walker Lewis eats both of you first. I'll distract I hope he doesn't die. I actually like him. Safe cover. Then I'll try to redirect the smelly patrol to give you guys a chance to sprint inside the building. When we get into position, I'll signal you. Then you can do your thing. Good luck. Okay. You got this, dude. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to kill some regardless, it doesn't matter. Please, let's make it quick. I don't freaking like this. That guy's dead, right? Oh god, he's not! Fuck! <laughs> Damn it, I knew it! <laughs> There's a walker inside. Was there not? I saw a walker. Yes, these will be perfect. Clint, look. Try it out. See if it works. It does. Gonna need your help on this one, kiddo. You still got your gun? Just in case. Okay. Just in case. AJ, I trust you. You'll be okay. <laughs> AJ? Good job, AJ. Is there more? Keep it coming. Okay, hurry. We have we don't have enough time though. Freaking jars that survive. I figured like everything would be destroyed. Stand. <gasps> Slowly. Don't yell. Don't try anything. I won't hurt you. If I don't have to. What do you want? I just want food. Same reason you're here. This is the guy who was smoking near the traps. 
and your friends made a lot of noise out there. It wasn't hard to follow. You live close by? It's none of your business. You knew about this place already. And organized some effort to get inside. Not saying anything. So you Fuck probably you. also knew the stash was there. Doesn't matter. Wasn't really a question. More like confirmation. You look a little young to be out on your own. You got a group? No. Count you plus the two outside. I'm thinking maybe more. You asked too, too many questions. Too many questions. I don't like it. Fine. We can play it like that. If you want. Now, I'm gonna fill this pack real slow. We worked hard to get this stuff. <gasps> well, hey there, Squirt. Playing hide and seek, are we? <gasps> AJ! Don't steal from us. I'm not stealing. This isn't yours. I can kill you, you know. Come on, kid. I'm faster than you. Listen up, Squirt. You're gonna quit pointing that gun at me and let me go my Mary. You understand? I'm just gonna take a little bit, then I'm leaving. Should I trust AG to shoot? She did say he's a good shot. You wouldn't let a hungry man starve now, would you? No, it's gonna attract noise. Get down! Hey! <laughs> Fuck you, dude! It would make too much noise if you shot what them. The fuck? Just take a bag and fill it up. Okay, I think that would be better because if he if he shot him, then I think that would have ended badly. Come on, Louis, let's go. Oh fuck! Come on, let's go! We have to leave! Just move! I'll tell you on the way! Jesus, I, I legit thought someone was gonna die there. Holy crap, I'm actually glad that I didn't let AJ shoot. I almost did because like, I remember Clem saying like, he's a good shot, so it'll be fine, but it would make a lot of noise. You are not listening to me, Marlon. Listen to me, I am telling you, the place was ransacked. It's fine, we'll deal with it. Take y'all a while. How poor are they that have not patience? There you go. Bitch! Check it out! Food! That's like a lot of food. Observant as ever, Mitch. I can't believe this. Look at it. You're our savior, Clem. Like, seriously. It's a lot. Team effort, not just me. Mason Violet helped too. Neither of them ever brought back this much before. Neither have you. <laughs> where did you find all this? The old train station. Clem knew where it was. Train station? That's outside the safe zone. We'd have even more, but we ran into the creep that fucked up our rabbit traps. Creep? What creep? Clem saw him smoking those nasty-ass Bible cigarettes. He had weird, different colored eyes. They know who it is. Did he follow you? Nope. I shoved him into a pack of walkers. It took a chunk out of him. It was awesome. Look, I don't know if he got out of there, but if he did, he won't make it for long. You attacked him? What the fuck? He was had a gun to us! Coming back for revenge. What the hell were you thinking? He this had a gun! Fucked. If I hadn't done what I did, he would have shot us. I made the right call. Bullshit! What if there were others? 
You don't know what people are capable of out there. I do know. Think again. Thank you. I just can't. I won't. You know who they are, don't you? Not again. Fuck! What the hell's going on here? She took them outside the safe zone. They saw someone. You know what that means. Enough! It just means there's a hungry guy out there looking for food. It's happened before. You are overreacting. You can't be serious. Come on, let's go somewhere and talk about this. Whoa, dude, what the if fuck? If anything happens, I'm holding you responsible. Clem, I know I asked you for help. You did, you did, but shit. God, nothing's easy. Um. Look, I'm sorry I broke the rules, but we were like, you know. Sorry I went outside the safe zone. We I had to. Didn't see any other option. Yeah, I know. It's just hard keeping us together. <laughs> well, at least we're eating tonight. In the next few, I'd wager. Um, it's better than nothing. Talk to Brody. Thanks for the haul, Clint. You guys should go enjoy it. You've earned it. Mm-hmm. Don't sweat it, Glenn. Ever since we lost Sophie and Minnie, Brody's been freaked out by anything that happens past the safe. I think it has to do with She'll their deaths, like the twins' deaths. Still, we should make sure this is a one-time thing. We can take Rosie out in the morning, see if she catches a scent. You know, just in case. I'm gonna go clean up. Okay. I think I'll go too. See you later. Bye. But yeah, I definitely think her no reaction is just because of I'm something that happened sad. with Sophie and Minnie. Sad. Why? My sisters died around this time last year. I think it's starting to get to people. Doesn't it get to you? Not really. Dying's not scary. I mean, it's sad, but not scared. I think becoming being a, a walker is a lot worse than being dead. How do you know? Maybe being a walker is really nice. I doubt it. Me too. But mm. it's not like you can go ask one. It's true. I try not to focus on them being gone. I like picturing where they'd be now instead. That's pretty nice. Sophie was awesome at making stuff. She'd build a place big enough for all of us to live. And paint it too. And Minnie be playing whatever new song she wrote. I guess death doesn't scare me because I know I have something waiting on the other side. Well, that's a nice way of thinking Someplace it. Someplace safe and happy. All of us together. Looks like a nice place to wind up. Yeah, I think so too. A lot better than some smelly old school. <laughs> Who are those guys? The walkers who killed them. You want them there too? They weren't always walkers. Wherever this place is, everyone gets to be a person again. Sometimes That's I draw nice. the walkers the way they probably looked. Sometimes I draw Minnie and Sophie the way they probably left them. But sometimes I draw this too. Can... can I be there? Sure. You want to be there too? I promise I'll draw you well. You, you know what? Sure. sure. Why not? Just foreshadowing. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. <laughs> Her hat. Here you go. It's yours. It's ours. That's sweet. It's getting late. Yeah. You guys should get some sleep. Aren't you coming? Not yet. I want to finish this first. 
Okay. Good night. See you tomorrow. Hmm. I don't like that. Kind of makes me concerned that someone's gonna die! Guy. Can I stay up? No. no. Two more minutes. Tell you what. <laughs> Usually it's like five more Come minutes. Yay, he's on the bed. Not in bed. By yourself. I like it here. I got to kill fish. <laughs> Violet looked like she was having a good time. It's nice, not driving everywhere or running away. Mm-hmm. But the ranch was nice, too. Before the blood. This isn't the ranch. Do you like it? I like it. Now that I'm used to it. I mean, for it's now... and the walls make it feel safe. It's good. Because I don't really know now, yet. But places change, so do people. Might not stay good. Don't worry, we're not leaving. There, you gotta stay up two minutes more. Time for sleep. I'll lay down when you <laughs> blow out the light. All right, give me a minute. Okay. Let's see. Place cat skull, cause like, That's why not? Cool. I know, right? <laughs> like, really cool. They do like that kind of stuff. Oh my god. Okay, uh. Where can I have the other one? Remember I got like a deer skull? Put there. Ten's drawing there? That's a good drawing. He's a good artist. Your picture is good too. Oh, I know. <laughs> He's confident. That's good. <laughs> so cute. For a clam from AJ. <laughs> okay, um... I'm so used to lugging this everywhere. Never knowing when we'd find any supplies. I feel a lot lighter. I'm not sleepy. <laughs> Liar. They always say that. Good night, sleep tight. Don't let a walker bite. And if they try, I never let them bite. Come on, play it right. One time, bang. <laughs> Good work, and thanks. And he's out. Um, what's going on? What's that? Shh. Don't light the candle, Clem. There's voices in the pipes. I think someone's in trouble. Is it us? No, no, no. Not right now. But we should help them. If it's a monster, we should kill it. I don't think it is. You got your gun. Uh-huh. Okay, I'll be good. right back. Oh, God, AJ, please stay safe. Stay safe. You okay? They sound mad. Don't worry. Maybe I'll it's like Marlin and Brody on. fighting? I know. I don't know what the hell's going on. Oh god, okay, um... Do I need my shit? Guess not. Let's go.
Be careful, AJ. Sounds like someone's pleading for help. Um... Just a little farther. Here? Basement. Oh god, why are they in the basement? <laughs> why do they have to be in the basement? It's always the basement. This locks from both sides. Can't pick it. I have to find another way to the basement. A cellar door out in the yard. Are you fucking kidding me? I guess I gotta go outside. I have a bad feeling. Oh great, the candle went out. That's nice. This is exactly what we want. According to the map, there should be another entrance to the basement around here. Um, somewhere? Can I find the cellar door? Okay. It's gotta be somewhere. I think we're gonna need this. Heavy. <laughs> yeah, it is. Um, oh, is this it? It's locked. hear that right they must be fucking deaf if they can't hear that okay let's see what's down here Clem don't make so much noise I I'm scared they said that we're in this together that's what it sounded like Marlin I think maybe You sound like you were yelling. Deserve some shut eye. You had a busy Um, day. doesn't sound like talking. Doesn't sound like a polite conversation. What are you fighting about? It's really none of your business. Go back to the dorm. I don't trust you. I was right. There was something weird going on here. The man you met at the station. We got history. Brody. I knew it. She's acting crazy. Shut the fuck up. I'm only gonna she listen to her. Sometimes she's just gotta tune it out. Don't be afraid, Brody. Say what you have to say. What history? Marlin let him take the twins. Him and his people. Brody! Ten sisters. I thought they were killed by walkers. That's the story we told everyone. Shut up! Cause what? Martin was so ashamed of what hey. she- Oh my god, okay, no! Uh, what'd you say? She- I'm sorry. She dead? What have you done? So, 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 so. You're gonna be okay, I, I promise. God damn it, hell! I told you not to say it! Get away from her. Come on, Marie, come on. I mean it, Marlin. Step back! <sighs> okay. Okay. Just, just stay with her. The, the, no, the, the, he's gonna blame us! Right? This dick! He's gonna say Clementine did it! Right? It's me, Clem. Just, just stay still. Who? 
Clementine, remember? We talked about driving up into the mountains, where you could see everything. Clouds. Clem, you're in danger. You and AJ both. What danger? Marlon will kill me if I tell. He's scared. And when he's scared, he gets angry. I'll deal with Marlon. I promise you that. Yeah. Yeah, you will. You're strong. And he's not. His no, he's a fucking mullet. Marlon said he'd let him take you. Take us? Ew! Is that why there's no females here? Like he did. <laughs> like he did with ten sisters. <laughs> Brody. <laughs> What the fuck? Oh. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. What the hell am I gonna do? She's gonna turn. Marlin! Oh! You son of a bitch! Don't do this! What? Oh my god, she's gonna turn! What a bastard! So that's why there's no females on this place! I knew there was something weird! And then when Violet was like, I, there's too many bros here! I knew it! Oh fuck. Oh god, oh god. Okay, okay. Is she still there? Where's the flashlight, yo? Oh my god. She's not there anymore, is she? Shit. My ass. Fuck my ass. Oh my god, I don't like this. She's turning! Cause some people turn real quick. Um, when they're dead. There's a ruler! Yes, this will work. Take it! Oh my god, I don't like this. Ew, why? Oh my god, okay, okay. Okay, we're okay. Oh god. Oh god. Hey, um, Brody? Brody, you, you still here? Brody? Brody? Oh! No! Hold! Shit! Go, Clem! Fuck, fuck, fuck. Hurry up! Go, 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 go! Oh my god, oh my god, please! Son of a bitch! Where's AJ? Put the gun down. Get this fucking psycho away from me! AJ? Where is she? She's in the basement. She murdered Brody. No, she didn't, you what? bastard! No, I'm gonna it's fuck this guy up. Place. Why Brody? Did you see it happen? 
Is she a walker now? Hey, Marlin! You might want to get your story straight. Flim! You killed Brody. You hit her so hard, her head split open. That's a lie! Oh, I'm gonna fucking call this bastard out. You kill her. What the hell is going on? Look at her hands! She's covered in Brody's blood! We saved their lives when anyone else would have kept walking. We fed them. How can you not tell that this guy's the one who did it? It's fucking lunatic. Guns being pulled in. Murder! Well, fuck them! Fuck! Marlin! Jesus Christ. You shoot me? And what do you offer up to your raider friends when they come knocking? What the hell is she talking about? I won't do it, because he needs us alive. Shut up! Brody told me Marlin was gonna give me and AJ up to raiders in exchange for safety. The same way he gave up Sophie and Minnie. Wait. Oh my god. Shut the fuck up, Clementine! Let no! Brody told me the truth, and that's when Marlin killed her! Come the fuck on! They only met up with these raiders because Clem insisted they go out there. Quite the coincidence, isn't it? Shame, I don't believe in those. Oh, fuck off. Think about how scared we all were when the adults left. I pulled us out of that fear. I gave us all courage again. Who are you all gonna believe, huh? Johnny come lately and a little fucking lunatic? Or me, your friend? She did help us get food. What good is food if a group of outsiders is just gonna come along and take it? You have to believe me. Come on, you know that. There's something wrong there. You don't. You met her like two days ago. Shut up. I don't know you, Clem. Damn it. I figured she. <sighs> I'm sorry. See, man? She can't even speak for herself because she knows she's full of shit. No! Oh, okay. I thought that was actually. I thought that was actually the fucking like uh, ending. I was about to say what. I guess you never will. Don't let her get in your head. Hey, what you want you to do? Find the truth, She's not fucking like. You. Fuck off! So, Clem, I. <sighs> Shit. It will all feel safer once I pull this trigger. You were there that day those raiders came? He would have abandoned you too! Yeah, fuck off! Violet being difficult. Why am I not surprised? Put down the gun, now. We're gonna do this the right way. Stand down, Marlon. Be reasonable. Mm -hmm. You gonna shoot all of them then, huh? You don't get it. You, you don't understand at all, do you? I'm trying to protect you! All of you! You failed so uh, spectacularly. Oh, by waving a gun around? Pointing a loaded gun around protect anyone! Brody's dead. Sophie and Minerva are gone. You suck at protection. Shut your fucking mouth! I made the right call. I saved the lives of everyone in this fucking school! No, you- this guy's just- <laughs> I do it again! Excuse me? Wow! You're so fucking expendable! You Did just admitted it! Die! I had to save the rest of you, okay? You gave my sisters away. Why would you do something like that? I trusted you, Marlin. They trusted you. Easy, because he's a coward.
I wanted to get them stage some kind of rescue. Honest, Ted, I just couldn't. I was just too afraid. You killed Brody because she knew. <laughs> I didn't mean to. I didn't want this. I wanted to save all of you. You can still fix this! Minerva! We can still fix this, Marlin. It's going to be okay. We can I always try. I always it's try to you. like reason with them first. We're all family here. The only one any of us has left. Drop the gun. <sighs> God. I know I betrayed you. All of you. Just let me leave. You'll never have to see me again. Let you leave? You'll probably go to your raider friends. Let me become a bad memory. Just give me that. Please. Oh my god. He's definitely not gonna be leader. Okay, that's like fucking for sure. But if I let him go, I feel like he would go to the raider friends and be like, Hey, I need help. I can join you. And then he would attack us, right? But like, keeping him as prisoner, I feel like that's not a good idea either, right? Because like, he can still like turn on us. Maybe I should tell him to get the hell out of here. Don't. AJ! I saved one for me. That is not what I was picture- What the fuck? <laughs> what did he do? Oh my god. Wow. AJ's a, a fucking- Yo, what the hell? That guy- Like, that kid has no- Like, he didn't flinch whatsoever. He just did it. Holy crap. Okay, um, sorry, let me just focus again. You and 52% of players killed the walkers in the couple station. Um, you and 56% of players went fishing with Violet and Brody. 50% let uh, AJ sleep under the bed. 61% of players attacked Abel rather than giving him food. Good, I'm glad a lot of us attacked him. 58% of players turned to Violet for help against uh, Marlin. Uh, yeah, that's kind of what I was expecting to. <laughs> what the heck? That was like intense. Actually, I kind of like this. Like the writing of this one is so much better. Holy crap, I'm actually impressed. Okay, uh, you and 58% of left guilt Violet feeling guilty. She was pleased after you complimented her fighting skills. Uh, Violet was flattered after you comforted her in the dorms uh, rooms. When you told to- okay, uh, you and 58% left Louis heartbroken when you told him about killing the loved one, he sympathized with your pain. Marlin is dead. Marlin was believed to be forgiven by his actions towards the twins, but in Brody, he felt proud when he trusted him with, uh, Rosie. Okay. You and 38% left 10 feeling bitter. 10 was under a setting of your, uh, Hesitancy when you first met him, when you allowed him to draw you, he generously gifted you his drawing. Okay. Well, I guess he's still bitter towards us. I don't know. You and 49% left AJ feeling ruthless. AJ was resolved to sleep under the bed after his first night of school. He was satisfied when you attacked Abel at the train station. Damn it! I guess that makes sense. I, I treated him more like a survivor than um, like how he normally is, you know what I mean? Damn, I should have let him sleep in the bed and I should have told him, No, we'll just go into crawl through the space and not kill the walkers and then maybe he wouldn't be a killer. <laughs> Brody is dead. Brody left grateful when you resolved the conflict between her and Violet. She was appalled when you downplayed the encounter with Abel. Omer was glad you checked in with him on dinner. Ruby was disgusted when you encouraged AJ's bad manners. Mitch was happy to show off his weaponary skills to you. 
As Sim was glad that you stopped AJ from reading his journal, you learned how to bond with Rosie and w with Marlon's help. Uh, Willie was fascinated by you when you met him the first time. Okay, we collected, uh, oh, there was more things to collect. Okay, so that's interesting. So that was a really interesting first episode of season four. Holy crap, I'm actually really impressed because, like, I really thought this was gonna be something really lame. Like, oh, the another, like, people attack. And yeah, it's still playing on that. Like, people are gonna attack them. But it's coming from inside the group rather than, like, it's just outside. You know what I mean? Because I, I really thought it was just gonna be the same old, oh, they stumbled upon the group and they want to attack them now because, you know, they owe them food or something like that. Kind of like how the, the, the brothers in uh, season one was when they wanted food and stuff. And same with season two, um, when they owed them because they escaped from uh, the encampment and stuff like that. But this one is just like he's trading the women off. I don't know. I don't want to know what they're doing with the women. I can only imagine but damn that's so fucked. But I'm really glad that I played this because I can't even. Um anyway so that comes to the end of episode one i hope you guys enjoyed my let's play for it um if you guys have played this episode please let me know in the comments what you thought and what your choices were did aj shoot marlin because i'm actually really surprised that he did that um but in case you want to watch my other let's plays for the previous seasons i have a link in the description to all the playlists to season one two and three if you would like to check it out and yeah i can't wait for episode two because wow <laughs> that was really interesting anyway if you guys enjoyed this video remember to leave a like subscribe and hit the bell button so you know when i upload the next episode for the walking dead and i will see you all in the next one bye come on come on laura we can get gotta get out of here oh my god no 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 get off he found his tongue wandering inside her mouth exploring slowly as she <laughs> I'm sorry, let me do that again. He found his tongue wandering in her mouth.